uh, Sam actually started working with us in the high school and just coming and training for football players. And Morgan's been working with me. She started training at Mountain Athlete before she started free skiing. They're both really kind of having breakout careers this winter, you know, at 18 and 19 years old. So that I've been I'm really excited for them. In high school, I did not do any other sports. I focused on skiing. It was definitely a sacrifice because I loved to play football before I started skiing. But if I wanted to ski at the level that I was aiming for, I wasn't able to pursue both. The other thing that really makes them stand out, in addition just to the, the, how professional they are about the sport, is how really smart they both are. Morgan has a She's humble about it, but she pretty much has a full ride academic scholarship in Millbury in Vermont. It's no joke. One of the major things that's changed for me this year is just that I've been able to solely dedicate all my time and efforts into skiing, which I have never been able to do in the past. I mean, last winter I was completely in school, so it didn't really work out that way. Before that I was ski racing, so this is the first year that I've really focused on my free skiing. I enrolled in Montana State University. My initial thoughts going there were uh, I was going to ski there and try to pursue a ski career in Bozeman, but as the winter came I realized that I really needed to sacrifice a few things to make my ski career work and that was sacrificing my winter semester at college. As far as Sam's skiing and what he's doing and trying to go to college as well, it's a passion of his. He's not going to be able to do this forever, so I'm extremely supportive of it. And to force him into just being a college student would kill that. It just would kill that. So for me, I would much rather have him pursue this, chase this dream right now, do whatever he can to get it, and he can always, always, always go back to school. I think just given a lot of opportunities to actually compete and actually put everything I have into skiing, things are starting to come together, which is really fun. I've learned a lot from Rob Gloria in the past couple months, and just getting these little techniques down that takes you from an amazing skier to professional skier. It's just little things that really transform your ski. Sam, you know, he's interesting. He, he wants to hit big airs and do backflips, um, and we've working a lot on his skiing, his flow. Uh, feature to feature, which is which is doing great. And he's got to sort of start to play on that strength as well, because you need the blend, you need air, and you need speed, feature to feature. Skiing with Rob Deloria has been awesome. It's really fun, and he's one of the most talented individuals, and he's done a lot for all of us, I think. So when you're looking at the venues, you got to know what you're really comfortable with, and you can do fast. Okay. Because speed and technical skiing, the judge is going to impress the judges, and you throw a couple knobs in there for some airs, and just stick them clean. You know, Morgan already at a young age, fifth comp, got a podium. She was on the, on the, you know, on the cusp. You know, all those other times, she finally was able to put it together in comp. Sam's had several top ten finishes, and so not only are they young and smart and driven but they're really good. I just feel that passion he has for it, love for it. That is thrilling as a mother to see your child so happy, so um, full of confidence and, and, and ability, and I just think that's gonna carry with him throughout the rest of his life. Yeah! <laughs>